Hello, children. Hello. Hello, Clive. Hello, Grandpa Joe. And welcome to the studio. Today, we are going to be drawing a kangaroo. That's one of those things that jot around Australia in the, in the outback. In the outback? Yes. So, um, what are we just doing? Are we just going to draw that today? Yes, we'll just draw that and then Carissa, who is the parrot, she can come along and then she can paint it because she needs to learn her colours with you. With me? Yes, and the other children as well. So let's just get straight on to the drawing then. Good idea. Right, grab the, the, uh, the lac pen. There we go. Good, good, good. And uh, let's start drawing. Okay, so um, let's draw. Let's draw. Let's draw an oval. So, if you want to draw an oval, children, draw an oval. That's right. An oval is that shape. Now we need to put some years on Grandpa Joe because I know kangaroos have got years. So let's put a couple of little years on like that. Oh, that's good. Yes, yes, yes. There we go. How's that? And let's. Let's give it a little bit of hair. There we are. Give it a feature. That's what they call a feature. Yes. Now you need a bit of circle for his nose. A circle for his nose. That's good. That looks good. That looks good. Um, we need a couple of eyes. A couple of dots for eyes. A couple of dots for eyes. And a big smiley mouth. A big smiley mouth. That looks really good, Clyde. You're doing a good job. Yes, I've had a lot of practice, Grandpa Joe. <laughs> Just got to get a bit comfortable here. So, we'll, let's put his body on now. So let's put a little bit of a curve there like that. And then another little bit of a curve there. And let's bring his, uh, let's bring his back up. Ka uh, kangaroos have got big tails. Big tails, yes. Very big tails indeed, they have, yes. So we need to put a big tail in then. So let's put a big tail in. There you go. And hopefully the children can draw along with this. Yes, he's looking pretty good. He is looking pretty good. Now we need to bring his belly down there like that. Let's put a big leg on. They've got big legs, Clive. Big legs. Big legs. Big long feet. And Put another leg in. We'll put a leg in the back like that. And we bring his up there like that. There we are. Looks as if he's he's bouncing around. Ho ho! Very good! Very good! Right, he needs some legs on the front. Let's put his little paws in. There we go. Put his little paws in like that. Put another one there. That is excellent. Now we need to put something down there. To make it look as if he's um, hopping, hopping up off the ground, hopping up off the ground. So let's put some grass in. And let's put some squiggly marks like that. So it looks as if he's hopping around. We'll put a bush there. And let's put some mountains in the background. That looks good. Looks good. Yes. There we go. And um, we'll put another little bush, maybe, but there, how's that? I think that looks excellent. Now, let's put, let's put a sun over there. Put a sun? Yes. Put a sun in there. Smiley face. Smiley face. Excellent. There you are, children. Easy kangaroo. Uh, drawn with Clive and me, Grandpa Joe. Now, what we're going to do, we're going to get Carissa in the studio and she's going to paint that and she's going to learn her colours as well. I think that's good. And you can go along and, and listen to her and learn your colours also. Yeah. Yes, so what colours do you think we should use, Grandpa Joe? Well, I think I'll leave that to Carissa. Okay then, so say goodbye then, Grandpa Joe. Goodbye, children. Bye!